Hey everybody, Lance Goyke here. Today we're discussing a, another pull-up variation. This one where I kind of scissor kick my legs. So one leg comes forward, one leg comes backward. Uh, what does it look like? So we're gonna do our best here. It's kind of like I'm walking, right? So one foot is ahead of the other, and then my body is kind of turned because my hands are on a pole that is fixed. So my hands have to be straight here. So if I'm bringing one leg forward, one leg back, my body has to rotate that way. And then I'm just doing a pull up with my legs in that scissor position. This is what it would look like if I switched. So it's easy to switch because your feet are just dangling in the air, right? You just kind of turn your body. Um, but that is the key. You need to turn your body for this. That's what makes it so unique. It's a lot like the uh, side to side pull up or the, the zigzag pull up that we had talked about previously. What I'm doing is I'm changing the position of the core. I am teaching you how to twist and how to contort in different ways so that when you pull yourself up, you have different shoulder mechanics. You have different scapular mechanics. You have different ways that your body has to move to do the exercise correctly. So how do you figure out how to do this correctly? Well, the the first, just do the position. But then second, you got to make sure that your, um, your shoulders stay evenly between your hands. That's kind of like the way that I would um, try to fix this. If your grip feels even, um, you're generally uh, adopting the right position, right? If I can feel my pinkies the same amount, on my grip, then I am contorting my body in a way that lets me actually grip the bar while I am twisting. Um, this is another good one. If, if you really do have asymmetries that you need to fix, if maybe one shoulder hurts, but the other one doesn't, or, um, or maybe one shoulder just like likes to ride up while you do your pull up and the other one doesn't, um, this is a good way to just kind of experiment around, right? So twist your leg and see which way feels better. See which way um, is harder. Um, and maybe practice a little bit more on the side that's harder. and Or maybe go slower on the way that's harder. Or maybe use less weight or more assistance on the side that's harder. And you can use this as an excuse to do all those things that you know are good for you, but you're, you're kind of avoiding because your ego won't let you. <laughs> uh, too true, <laughs> too true. Uh, scissor kick, pull up. Great for introducing rotation, great for teaching the core how to turn on the right way and adopt the right positions, and great for shoulder mobility while you're actually training your pull up.